Grounded theory is a research approach for systematically developing a substantive theory that is grounded in the collected data. In this guide, we will conduct a grounded theory analysis with the help of MaxQDA, the leading tool for grounded theory across the research community. In these four easy steps, open, initial coding, advanced coding, theory visualization, and theoretical integration and writing up. But first, what exactly is grounded theory? Characteristically, for the grounded theory approach is its iterative cyclical research process, data collection, analysis, and theory development. Often don't occur in linear succession, but rather in continuous interplay. This process is guided by theoretical sampling, the deliberate selection of additional data based on emerging theoretical concepts. With a grounded theory approach, diverse types of data can be incorporated into the analysis. Interviews, observation protocols, documents, photographs and images, audio and video materials. MaxQDA supports you in integrating and systematically analyzing all these data types. Step 1 of grounded theory analysis with MaxQDA – Open Initial Coding In the initial phase, researchers engage very intensively and closely with their data. This typically involves line-by-line -line analysis and generates numerous codes. To make initial open coding even more efficient, MaxQDA provides a rich set of specialized features. For example, you can activate open coding mode for any text. Once you highlight a text segment and release the mouse button, a window automatically opens where you can enter a code name. And, if desired, add your analytical thoughts and key insights about the code and the coding decision. With in vivo coding, analytically significant words or phrases from your data material become code names themselves. In this way, you can easily maintain the authenticity of your data. To do so, we simply highlight a text segment and then click the in vivo coding icon. And of course, you can also work with highlighter colors by selecting a color here. When you color mark passages, they are automatically coded. This way, you can easily locate and compile the segments later. Step 2 of ground and theory analysis with MaxQDA – Advanced Coding Once you've completed initial coding of your first datasets, your next challenge is to elevate the analysis to a more abstract level. This involves reviewing, analyzing, merging, and abstracting codes to develop them into categories. In the codes window, you can structure codes into main codes and subcodes. Perfect for grouping similar aspects and concepts and introducing more abstract analytical terms. In the codes window, you can also merge two codes and thus structure your code system. With the Creative Coding workspace, you can take this even one step further. When you launch Creative Coding, a new window appears. On the left, you'll see your current code tree from the codes window. The empty canvas on the right is your workspace. Here, you can drag codes into the space and arrange them. Using Creative Coding, you can arrange similar codes in proximity to each other. Merge codes simply by dropping one code onto another. Insert more abstract terms and create relationships using arrows to connect them with subcodes. And as your project progresses, these may evolve into categories depending on their level of abstraction and theoretical significance. And you can apply different colors to individual codes and code groups to create conceptual boundaries and make similar codes instantly recognizable. These code colors appear throughout MaxQDA, serving as a powerful analytical marker. When you're done, you can transfer your new structure directly to the codes window. While coding is central to grounded theory analysis, equally crucial is the continuous practice of memo writing. Memos accompany your entire research journey and serve as a primary tool for theory development. Memos are written analytical records that capture your thoughts, ideas and insights throughout the research process. In MaxQDA, you can attach memos 
to different types of your data. For grounded theory studies, here's how you might utilize different memo types. Memos within your data, in document memos, can capture analytical thoughts, insights and interpretations about specific text passages or image sections. Memos attached to codes, code memos, can record analytical insights about codes, categories or concepts. And memos attached to cases or documents, so-called document memos, can store supplementary information about individual cases and data collection contexts, create case summaries or record case-specific analytical insights. With the Memo Manager, you can get an overview of all of your memos. For instance, select Memos, Code Memos, to view all memos attached to your codes. In the Memo Manager, you can read, edit, filter, and compile sets of related memos, and later export them as well. Step 3 of Grounded Theory Analysis with MaxQDA Visualizing your theory through progressive coding, significant categories and theoretical relationships between these categories begin to crystallize. Creating a concept map of your current understanding serves as an excellent catalyst for theory development. In MaxQDA, you can create concept maps using the MaxMaps workspace. Here, you can design a new concept map and bring any elements from your project onto the canvas. Your map might include specific categories, coded segments from your original data, and memos containing analytical insights. Connect elements using lines and arrows, and add meaningful labels. Enhance your visualization by adding free text fields, circles, rectangles, and other shapes to the map. MaxMaps also offers you different model templates that automatically transform key components of your project into visual maps. For grounded theory analysis, the code theory model proves especially valuable. It visualizes a category with its subcategories alongside associated memos containing your analytical insights. Just as in creative coding, every element in Max Maps maintains a live connection to your MaxQDA project. Double-click any element to instantly access original data, coded segments, or analytical memos. This enables you to move fluidly between abstract theoretical relationships and their empirical foundations. Step 4 of Grounded Theory Analysis with MaxQDA Theoretical Integration and Writing Up Developing a grounded theory is a cyclical journey. The activities we looked at in the previous steps – coding, category development, visualization and writing memos – are revisited multiple times. New data is analyzed following this approach, and when necessary, additional data is collected. Fresh insights are woven into your emerging theory until theoretical saturation is achieved. Then comes the greatest challenge – theoretical integration. For that, MaxQDA equips you with powerful tools. Using the Memo Manager, introduced earlier, you can compile all your theoretical memos, filter them by different concepts, and systematically weave them into a coherent theory create additional integrative memos or transfer your insights directly into your research report as building blocks for writing up your theory. Of course, you can also export any selection of memos as a text file. In the QTT workspace, you can bring together all vital elements of your analysis. Research questions as your foundation, key codes and categories, essential memos, relevant quotes, visualizations, and theoretical insights. For every element you add to QTT, you can write down your analytical insights, which automatically flow into an integration of findings section. Think of the QTT workspace as your bridge between analysis and research report. These collected insights, visualizations, and quotes provide an ideal foundation for crafting your grounded theory. Additional support for your grounded theory analysis can be found in MaxQDA's Virtual Research Assistant, AI Assist. MaxQDA's AI Assist add-on can enhance various stages of your analysis. Not as a substitute for your interpretative work, 
but as a complementary tool to sharpen theoretical sensitivity and deepen data exploration. Summarize texts, summarize coded segments, chat about a text, chat about a document, and chat about coded segments. With its diverse set of features, MaxQDA enables you to perform dedicated mixed methods analysis from start to finish. We wish you all the best for your grounded theory analysis with MaxQDA. Subscribe to our channel for more tutorials for beginners and advanced users.